Good morning, Merry Christmas to you. If you celebrate, I'd like to wish you a very, very Merry Christmas today. And it is 10.38 a.m., 54 degrees outside, Monday, December 23rd. So for us, it is Christmas Eve Eve. So I still have my Rocks Box earrings on. I'm still borrowing them from Rocks Box. So um, before we get started with today's vlog, I picked these up when we were in Florida. And um, they've been sitting in the suitcase for safekeeping and so here is this one that I purchased from Robert's Christmas Tree Store. So pretty, absolutely love it. And then this one. So pretty, I can't believe I completely forgot about these. Anyway, so there are those. I'm going to hang them someplace. Now, see that Terry's already given me the crystal hanging from the wreath, so that's gonna stay there, but I will find a beautiful place to put those. Well, this will just go on the tree. Anyway, okay, so hello, welcome to today's vlog. I know it is Christmas Day for you, or whatever day you happen to be watching this, but this is going to go live on Christmas Day. So again, Merry Christmas to you. Um, I'm going to wrap gifts today. I have already cleaned my bedroom. My bedroom is already ready to go. Um, I just need to dust real quick in there, but that'll take me just a couple of minutes. Um, and then I'll run the vacuum again. Uh, tomorrow's Christmas Eve, so I'll run it again tomorrow evening. Um, and uh, the whole house, and that way it's nice and fresh for Christmas morning when the family gets here. I'm gonna get this organized and I'm gonna go in my closet and take out the shirt boxes and I will be back and we will talk about what's on the table. Okay, so the first item, I don't have boxes big enough for everything. I totally forgot to get boxes this year. If I can find it, this is a sweater for Sarah. I will pop a picture up on the screen if it's still available. But that is going in here. There we go. And that's for Sarah. And it's from Nordstrom and it's super duper soft. And that's one of the reasons I picked it up, these shorts. <laughs> anyway, and then here is the sweater, the uh, scarf that came in the Ellen box. So that is for Sarah. And let's see. No, I have not resolved that yet. So that's that, and then in here, I have to open these things because I haven't yet. Okay, so this is a little mug, a water mug with Harry Potter on it. And this is a coffee mug. Does I solemnly swear that I am up to no good? Okay, that's for Sarah. This is for my son, Robbie. And these socks are for uh, Devin. These are Devin socks. Okay. Yeah, I really am going to need some boxes. That's for Sarah. That is for Chandler. And that is for Taylor. And that is for Robbie. Every year. My kids get a Lego, and I get a Lego every year. This is for Taylor. It's just a, an extension set. That is for Taylor. That is from Home Depot. Um, let's see. This is for Grandma. Jammies, super soft jammies for Grandma. And we got her a robe, super duper soft robe. Um, that's a flower print on there to match her jammies. So that will be for Grandma. The earlobe for heavy earrings. This is dice for my son. This is for my oldest son's stocking. This is for Taylor. Okay. That is for Taylor stocking. This 
This is for Chandler stocking. And this is a gift for Taylor. It's a wireless Bluetooth um, meat smoker thermometer. This is for Sarah. This is a keyboard. This is a mechanical keyboard for Chandler. Um, I'm not going to open it. I'm going to leave it just like this. Uh, I don't know the brand. I don't know anything about it. It is... Um, he picked it out and uh, sent me a link and I purchased it. This is a glue gun for Devin. She wanted a glue gun for This is a doorknob for my house. A hook and a purse for Sarah. She likes very small purses. I have this purse and I really, really like it. So, and I noticed hers was a little worn, so I got another one for her. And then here is the strap. And I will make sure if she doesn't like it, she can exchange it or return it, whatever she'd like to. Something for Robbie, he sent me the link. I don't know what it is. I think it's something to do with a card case. I don't know. And next year for paper, I will not be buying from Costco. I'm gonna get brown paper next year so that it can be recycled. Um, well, it may take me years to actually go through this. The last rolls of Costco wrapping paper we got lasted us like three years, so. We may have this one for a while, but that is the plan. Get recycling, recyclable paper next year. Okay, so we're going to get started. Um, all right, we're going to get started here. So this is reversible paper. So we have snowflakes on the inside and stars on the outside. And I have some snowflake ribbon here. I don't know. We'll see what we do. Oh, and that is for Devin, it's not in yet, and that is for Sarah, and it's not in yet. So I'm gonna wrap the little piece of the printout so that they know more is on the way. Again, Kroger, again. And this one actually had two on it. One on the top and one on the pants. Okay, that's enough wrapping for you. I'm gonna finish wrapping and I'll change my battery. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so I'm done wrapping presents. Um, I couldn't wrap grandma's like I showed you because the little tag thing was still on it. That's really frustrating. Um, they put two on there because she removed one, but they had tucked another one up in the pants. That was really frustrating and I don't know when we're gonna have time to get it back over there. So. We'll do it as soon as we can. But I'm gonna show you the presents under the tree, and then um, I'm gonna show you Mint Mongoose, the dogs need to potty. Show you Mint Mongoose, and then um, I don't know what we're gonna do. I need. I still haven't cleaned off my kitchen counters. I gotta do that. And um, go potty. So I need to do that, and then um, the family's not gonna be home for dinner tonight. They all left. It's, um, the boys went with dad to help him with the truck today instead of me because I have so many things to do. So, um, anyway, and to kind of give mom a break from it. <laughs> so, there you go. Jojo, go potty. And there's the poinsettia over there Rob got in the hot tub. So, you gonna take a nap? You gonna take a nap? Look at those toenails. Oh my goodness. Daddy will trim them this weekend. So the decking's still looking good. What are you doing? Hey, Papa! Hi, great face. Oh, you're so pretty. Did your boys come home to see you? Anyway, oh, I can't turn you that way. We got potty and pups. Anyway, the recycling. Um, now I need to break down all the recycling, get the trash over, 
and clean off the kitchen counters. I'm gonna show you mint mongoose. I'm gonna show you the presents under the tree because I think they look pretty. And uh, the stockings are done. Look, the backs of all the cards. <laughs> all right, let's go inside. All right, there we go. I think it looks nice. So the cat <laughs> box. Anyway, hi little bit. Biddle, hi. What are you doing? Resting? Oh, little dog's being a problem. Let me go get him. Little dog, get over here. Mister, oh my goodness. Every time, every time you make me think of the pink song. Da na 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 na. I'm gonna get in a fight. That's you. That's what I think about with you, because you are a little stinker, and all you want to do is wrestle with the dogs that live next door to us. Hey, hey, stop it. Come on, come on. <laughs> come on. You go inside, mommy's gonna take care of the trash and recycling, I'll be right back. Okay, so <laughs> I admit that I'm a mess. Let's uh, do our mint mongoose. I took off my Kendra Scott earrings because they were becoming quite heavy on my ears and I put on the ones that came in my Balsano bag. Really like those, I think they're really pretty. So let's do this very quickly. Okay, now you guys know I really like mint mongoose. I've put on the screen all the information about this box. Bag, excuse me. So there we go. All right. Oh. Oh, she put me a little put a little note for me. Oh, Helena, you're very welcome. It was my pleasure. So there we go. Let's see what is in for December's I'm bagging. Yep. Okay. So there's the candy. The candy is in here, it's just not in there. It's in here. I'm going to put that in my son's uh, stocking. There we go. Oh, Grayson is eating. I couldn't figure out what that noise was. All right. Comes nicely packaged with the little um, tag on here. It's really nice. Uh, you get discounts if you're a member at the shop and uh, spend $40 on individual items in the online shop and receive your next box free. So there you go. I have purchased things from the shop. Oh, you guys, this is so pretty. Oh my goodness, look at that. How perfect for the holiday season. Oh my goodness, that is beautiful. So pretty. All right, let's put this on. And of course you can, um, I'll explain what that noise was in a minute. Okay, so you can um, see the nice little tag hanging off of it. Just makes it a step above, you know, ordinary. It's nice, it's nice to have the, the tag for the jewelry hanging there. Just finishes it off and you can adjust the sizing. Now mine is in rose gold, but there is silver and gold. That is so pretty. Although I will say this one's really pretty in the rose gold. Okay, now let's do the earrings. Oh, these are pretty. Oh, these are really, really pretty. You guys run on off and order a set for December. I just, you can't beat the price for this. Oh, look. Now excuse my ugly fingernails. I know, I know. Look, those are so pretty great sparkly piece for the holiday. Now, I would assume you could wear these two ways. You could wear them as ear crawlers, where you could wear them up your ear crawlers like this. Whoops, I'm sorry. Ear crawlers up your ears like this, or you could wear them down, which is how I would wear them, just because ear crawlers kind of annoy me. They irritate my ears. Feeling them there irritates my ears. So I would have them like this, and I would want them to face, you know, angle the way my, my face does naturally. I really like that. I like these a lot. Really nice piece for Christmas. Perfect set for the holidays. Really nice set for the holidays. So there you go. Okay, you guys. 
Um, if you want this set, you can run and get it very quickly before the end of the month. That's nice. I don't know that she could get it to you before Christmas, but you can certainly order it. All right, you guys. This is one of the best ones we've gotten. I like this. I like this a lot. So I might shorten this a little bit. The noise was Addie chewing one of the presents. In all of her years, she has never chewed anything. Ever. Never. Not even as a puppy, she didn't chew anything. She feels guilty. She's over here very guilty for what she did because she got in trouble. And she's got, I think, I don't know. I don't know if the presents made her nervous. Are you feeling guilty, mommy squirrel? It's okay. Mommy forgives you. You didn't ruin it. You didn't ruin it. It's okay. Okay, I'm going to go put this away. And um, these are so lightweight. I really, really like these. And um, then I'm going to, what am I doing? What am I doing? I'm cleaning the kitchen. Aha, joy. <laughs> Rob left his phone at home. Um, it just went off and I was like, oh, he's back home. No. Anyway, um, I picked up a new doorknob for our back door and I'm gonna install that very quickly before I do the kitchen because um, our door keeps flying open and it's frustrating. So I need to um, change it out. So I'm gonna do that super simple. I mean, probably won't even take me five minutes. So, all right, you wanna see? I'll show you, hold on. I got the kitchen clean. I need to figure out what to do with the Ellen box and my paper box is in. I do need to get that filmed this week, but you will see that. It feels so good to get this stuff done. You know, it's just a couple of days of just tidying up because life had gotten, had taken control of getting my everyday things done. So everything's done now and I just feel so much better about it. Um, I need to remember to take the time just 15, 20 minutes every day instead of once or twice a week to just tidy up and do my normal things and then I don't have to worry about it. I used to be very scheduled, um, but uh, lately life has sort of interfered in my schedule. <laughs> so uh, it's time to make a new schedule. So 2020 is going to hold a lot of new routines and new things for me. Um, you know, it's just gonna be a less is more kind of life in 2020. Okay, so there we go. Yeah, I need to find a place for that. Sorry, that's my light. Let me come this direction. It's so much better. Uh, you know, it took me 10 minutes. It literally took me 10 minutes just to pick up the clutter off the counter. I had a little thing over here that held pens and my scissor and things like that. No, I don't want that on the counter. So I took it off the counter. Um, and got back to the basics. But this corner over here really drives me crazy, but there's nothing I can do about it. We use my toaster oven, air fryer, all the time. And almost every day it's used. And my coffee pot is now back over here where it was before. Um, you know, I like the light. Oh, the top of it. I wiped it off, but I didn't buff out the... Anyway, I gotta wipe that off again. Um... It's fine here. I think it'll be fine there and um, you know <laughs> that's where it's gonna stay. It still gets to be the coffee corner but it's actually usable. The stuff that's on there isn't just piled up on there. It's used and in my drawer here is where all my extra coffee is, where my tea is and I have some up in this cabinet as well. So there we go. Yeah I know you hear my dishwasher. Um, that's I we don't know what happened. So it's got some air in the line somewhere. Anyway, and then looking this way, I know the light. There we go. I need to push my chair under, anyway, in. So that's grandma's present over there. We need to go to Kroger and have them remove the security tag. That is my Ellen box, which I don't know what to do with. Um, my paper box, sweet kitty cat in a box. What are you doing, baby? Are you having a rest? Do you know how cute you are? Do you love your box? You're spilling out of your box because you're a big kitty. 
Anyway, I am so glad we rearranged everything. We pulled everything out. It just feels good to get the house back to its normal state. That's next. That's my cookbook. The two things on top are for Taylor, or three things, excuse me, those three things are for him to take home. Um, as soon as I can, I'm gonna organize all of that. And then this room, just open. Oh, it makes me so happy. I just, my gingerbread house is still there. We're gonna work on that. It's gonna go on that shelf right there. So I just, Oh, it feels so nice to be free from the clutter. Look, my sign always gets crooked. This is from our friend, Bob. I want to uh, hang it better. I think I'm gonna get the uh, sticky command strips, put it there. You guys, do you know what that's from? That's from the Friends TV series. But seriously, I actually wanna paint my door purple. I mean, I know it doesn't really match anything in my house, but it doesn't have to. <laughs> I want it to be purple so that the frame, anyway, I know it's ridiculous, but I, that's what I want to do. Anyway, um, I need to paint the door and I need to, um, the cables, those are about to go. Those are for my server. Um, those are going uh, because the server's going back in my office. Let's get started. It is the 23rd, correct? Yes. 24th, there's the 24th. Uh, is there a 25th uh, or is it just through the 24th? There's the 23rd. Just through, so tomorrow's our last day. This, oh, here's the uh, sleigh and, uh, or sled and dog and our husky and a toy, our toy rocket ship. All right, let me get to building. Okay, so there's the pup. Whoops. There's the pup with his, her sleigh. And here's a little toy rocket for a present for one of the minifigures around the tree. Okay, you guys, well, that's it for today. Thank you so much for spending the day with me. I really appreciate it. Um, we have a little present wrapping done today. I uh, told you all of our gifting secrets for today. And we got some cleaning done and our advent. And tomorrow we're going to uh, put our gingerbread house in place and place all of our advent calendar pieces in my Lego collection. And I will share that with you tomorrow and uh, get all that finished. And I've got some final baking to do. For me, tomorrow will actually be Christmas Eve. My husband, I'm sorry, I have to share this with you. So, <laughs> Rob left his phone at home, and whenever he does something like that and the kids are with him, he always makes them text me something very flowery just <laughs> to embarrass them. And it doesn't work with my middle son. It doesn't embarrass him at all because he's very flowery, flowery with his girlfriend, fiance. But Chandler hates it. <laughs> Chandler hates doing it. So this was the quote. Father says, wow. Okay, so what he said on our way home, I said, yay, love you, be careful. And he says, father says, wow, that's incredibly sweet. We love you very much and we are anxiously awaiting being home with you. We love you so very much. You are truly a magical person and we love being around you. <laughs> oh my goodness, I love my family so much. I love that we laugh and that we're silly and goofy and I just love it. I love my family and, and I hope that you have a wonderful time with yours. I hope Christmas Day was incredibly special for you and filled with whatever makes your heart smile the widest, no matter what that may be. And if you don't celebrate Christmas, I hope you had a wonderful day. I had a, had a warm day if you wanted it to be warm or a snowy day if you wanted it to be snowy. Whatever kind of day you wanted to have, I hope you had it. So thank you so much for spending the time with me. We will see you tomorrow, which is Christmas Eve for me. Thank you very much. Oh, please hit the thumbs up button. I'd appreciate it. <laughs> oh, I hate saying that. <laughs> All right, thank you so much, you guys. Very Merry Christmas to you. Happy holidays to you. And we will see you tomorrow. <laughs>